Here, friends, we're gonna draw a cupcake. Yeah, we're gonna draw a St. Patrick's Day cupcake. It's gonna be a lot of fun, and we hope you're gonna follow along. You ready to start? Yeah. First, we're gonna draw the bottom of our cupcake. Let's draw a line like that that goes across and towards the bottom down here in the middle so that we have room. We could draw it right about here so that we have room for the cupcake above. Yeah, there you go. And then we're gonna draw a line coming up and it's kind of diagonal. See how it gets a little wider at the top. Oh, nice job. And then we're gonna draw another line over here. Awesome. Okay, now let's draw the bottom of the frosting that's on our cupcake. We're gonna draw, almost looks like water. We're gonna draw a popcorn line that connects the top of the bottom of our cupcake. <laughs> yes, and now we're gonna draw the top of our cupcake and we're gonna draw it kind of like a cloud. We're gonna draw bumps that come around and connect to the other side. <laughs> I love yours. It really looks like a cloud. It looks super fluffy. Thank you. And really tasty. Thank you. <laughs> Now we need to add our funny face to our cupcake. I'm going to draw a smile right here in the middle. And then I'm going to draw it open too so that my cupcake is really happy. And you can change your funny face and make it different any way you want. <laughs> okay, I'm going to also add a tongue inside. And then let's color in the top part of our mouth but leave the tongue white. Now let's draw the eyes. I'm gonna draw a circle this size and the same circle over here for the other eye. And you could change yours. Yeah, if you, <laughs> are you drawing upside down use? Yes. Your, your cupcake is extra happy. It's way more happier than mine. <laughs> All right, and then I'm gonna draw highlights in my eyes. This is the highlight that makes the eyes look really shiny. It just looks like a cupcake, a really funny cupcake, except we need to make it into a, a St. Patrick's Day cupcake. Let's draw a clover right here on the wrapper or the bottom part. First, we're gonna draw a heart. But look at, at the bottom of the heart, I didn't connect it. This is for the top leaf. And then if you want to, you can turn your paper sideways if that helps. And then you can draw another heart right here, but also don't connect it. Yeah, there you go. And then we can turn our paper the other way too. And then let's repeat that same step. Draw a heart, but not connect it. And upside down. <laughs> oh, yeah. If you want to turn it into a four leaf clover, you could. But well, let's leave it like this. And right here, I'm gonna draw two curves coming down and then connect those at the bottom for the stem. And we did it! We finished drawing our St. Patrick's Day cupcake. Except we're not completely done. We still need color. My favorite. And this part we're going to fast forward, so remember to pause the video and take time to color your drawings. Yeah. You ready to speed things up? Yes! Olivia, we did it! We finished drawing and coloring our cute little cupcakes. I especially love yours and these little squiggly sprinkles that you added. What, what are these? Eyebrows? <laughs> we also added this on top. What is it? A leprechaun hat. Yeah, and our art friends can add even more things. We added stars, sprinkles, oh, and cute little cheeks. But what else could our, our friends add? A background. Oh yeah, a background. Or maybe even a pot of gold and a rainbow. You can also add more cupcakes. Oh, even more cupcakes would be better. We also used our markers to color with, but you can use whatever you have at home or in the classroom. Like colored pencils or even, what are these called? Oil pastels or crayons. Yeah. We hope you have fun drawing a cupcake with us. We do. We hope you had a lot of fun and we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Goodbye.